it's good on have lithium ion. Um, but I also got this charger. Um, I got a really good deal on a bunch of stuff. I got a saw and a drill 3701. The substantial piece of wood. This is a two by ten. This is a real two by ten, not a one and three quarters by ten. So it's Thursday, September twenty fourth, two thousand nine. Today, what I'm going to do is take three different batteries and see how they uh, do pulling current on using this Ryobi five and a half inch circular saw. So I've got the saw connected to the battery over here. We're going to start with a standard Ryobi battery. This is a 2.4 amp hour NICAD. And see what kind of current it pulls, how it does cutting through a... Pulls around 3 to 4 amps with no load on it. That's okay until it gets all the way into the wood and then it it just can't do it it's it's pulling 20 amps plus but Okay, this thing looks the same, more or less, as the uh, NICAD, but I've taken out all the NICADs and put in nickel metal hydride, 3.5 amp hour, uh, not quite twice as much, and, but uh, let's see how it does. No load, <laughs> still pulling about the same, around 3 to 4 amps. So we'll start with the easy stuff. So it does good on the easy stuff. We'll do another one. It bogs down when it starts to get into the middle, but keeps going. Let's try another one. Um, almost all the way through. Okay, it did have a little trouble there at the... Uh, when it got to the middle, let's see, let's see if it can keep going or, and I'm gonna, just going to kind of go straight through without stopping. Okay, it did have trouble near the end. Okay, <clears throat> the last uh, battery is this uh, lithium ion. It's a 2.4 amp hour, I believe. And when I said 2.4 amp hour on the NICAD, I think I really should have said 2.0. It's not rated at 2.4. So 3.5 on the nickel metal hydride is a lot more, almost twice as much as a 2 amp hour NICAD. But anyway, we've got the lithium ion, and I'm just going to, I have a problem with the amp meter, so I'm just going to run this a few times and see if it holds up similar to the nickel metal hydride 
no current test. I think it's going to draw a similar amount of current to the nickel metal hydride. So let's see what happens. Whoops. Got it reversed. Trying to switch this thing around. So if this thing is drawing 8 amps during a normal cut, at least this kind of a cut, and it's a 2 amp hour or uh, in this case 2.5 roughly amp hour battery, then it's going to last about 20 minutes because it's pulling three times what it's rated at for an hour. But those peaks, when it peaks at over 20, you start doing that on the nickel metal hydride. So you know it's going to do it here too. Those over 20 peaks really pull it down. So this thing is performing similar to the nickel metal hydride. I don't think 